Hi everyone, it's Sammy Caps. As an ARPG lover, I had the pleasure of playing a lot of ARPGs and I could have not picked a better time as I believe we are in the golden era of just not video games, but also ARPGs. We have seasoned veterans like the Diablo franchise and Path of Exile. And this year, a new player came to the fold with the 1.0 launch of Last Epoch. And I would be a fool not to mention other worthy ARPGs like Grim Dawn and Titan Quest, just to name a few. And my personal favorite, the OG of ARPGs, the game that paved the road and made ARPGs what they are today, Diablo 2. What a gem. If you've been with me since the beginning, you know that I've been a strong advocate of all of them. They are all good games in their own right. Some further ahead, while some struggling to find their position. But today, I want to discuss my future plans with a game I was a huge fan of when it first launched. Diablo 4, and how my optimism for that game has eroded over time. Now, I wanted to ride into the sunset and not discuss this, but the constant barraging and questioning around my support for this game and whether I will play it or not play it are too strong, and I need to address this. If you don't care about Diablo 4 and whether or not I will be playing it, you can save the time and skip to the next video if you wish. And hopefully I'll get to see you in my next video. I do not want to dwell on this topic, so it's going to be short because I've already moved on, but I owe it to part of my community to at least explain why I made the decision I did. We'll see you on the other side. Now, I know a lot of you are probably shaking your head and like, who the hell cares what game you play? Believe me, I'm shaking my head too. But you're not the one experiencing on a daily basis the same questions over and over regarding Diablo 4 and my involvement with the game and why I'm not playing it. So I need to nip this in the bud and... To be honest with you, this is a small percentage of my community. Very small. Very, very, very small. The vast majority understand what's going on and they realize why I'm doing what I'm doing. Or at least I hope so. So please, before I get into my little explanation here, please understand this is a very small 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 minute part of my community um, but i have to say it because i do have a substantial amount of players in my community that were with me in the beginning and rode the diablo 4 wave okay enough said so let's cut to the chase this is not going to be a long video because like i said in my opening monologue, I've already moved on. And news flash, I have not. Currently, right now, the PTR for season six is happening. And if you were with me on my last live stream, you will you saw that I'm not uh, participating in it. I'm currently playing Path of Exile, which I'm having a blast. I'm on my third character in the Settlers League. So I'm, I'm having a great time. And of course... All my latest videos are on the early access release of Path of Exile 2, which I will be streaming and grinding the hell out of. So that is kind of the future for Sammy Cap's live streams and my content. It's going to be 90, 95% around Path of Exile 2, which I'm really looking forward to. And time will tell how that game will flush out. So, getting back to the topic at hand, why am I not playing Diablo 4? Well, very quickly, the fact is that, as I said, I was a huge, huge supporter, cheerleader for that game when it first launched last year. 
and I am not going to get into all the minutiae. I have hundreds of videos on my D4 playlist uh, on my YouTube channel that you could go and watch. And basically, my explanation of why I'm not playing Diablo 4 are really in those videos. As you can see, the ebbs and flows, the ups and downs of my jubilation when they hit it and my disappointment when they didn't and the disappointments far outweighed the jubilation and of them hitting the mark on what i thought was what was needed in a good arpg and let's i'm gonna call it what it is it's very clear to me that diablo 4 the direction that it's going in is not something that I enjoy. And to be quite honest with you, my YouTube channel is not, I don't want it to be about negativity and highlighting all the flaws in games. Now, it's natural. Every video game has pros and cons. There is no perfect video game out there. Uh, but I... I found that over time, as the Diablo 4 journey was, in the beginning, it was going up and down, up and down, you know, and, and I personally feel it peaked at season four, but it was always up and down, up and down, trending down, if that makes any sense. And the latest installment of it, where it just, again, it looks like they're going down backwards not forward and i am not going to enjoy playing that kind of game i didn't enjoy playing it so why would i create content around it and why would i play a game i don't enjoy i wear my emotions on my like my you can tell when i am not enjoying myself and i don't want my community and my audience to see that. I, I love video games. I wanna play video games to put a smile on my face. I wanna play a video game that challenges me. I wanna play a video game that has purpose. I wanna play a game that is suitable to the era that we're in. I don't want games, I don't wanna play games that I believe are going backwards and have no ingenuity. They're not evolving. I, I, I don't want to be part of that. Now, you may disagree with me, and so be it. And by the way, if you're playing Diablo 4 and you love it and you're enjoying it, amazing. That's great. Enjoy. We all have our own criteria of what a video game should be. And who's? don't let anyone tell you what you should and shouldn't play. That's a personal choice. So I'm not saying that Diablo 4 is bad. I'm just saying Diablo 4 is not for me. And that is why I chose not to play it and or create content around it. And if I'm being transparent, I was kind of getting tired of the toxicity and uh, that's not healthy for anyone. So I've moved on. I've thoroughly enjoyed my playthrough of Path of Exile my only beef of path of exile is i should have started playing it a lot earlier i would be much further ahead with the knowledge and experience of the game but so be it it is what it is and i'm really looking forward to path of exile 2 early access on november 15th so that's it in a nutshell i'm not saying one game is better than the other i'm just sharing with you what I personally am doing and why I made the decision I made. I want to have fun. I want to enjoy the games that I play and I want to be, I want the games that I play to have purpose. And to me, Path of Exile, PoE2 provide that outlet for me. Nothing bad against any other game because they are all good games in their own right. Anyway, I hope that kind of sheds light on where I'm at. And for those of you that are strong advocates of Diablo 4 and you feel like I've let you down, my apologies, that was not my intent, but I wanna stay true to myself and my content. So I'm just telling you 
the way that it is. And hopefully you'll understand. All right, everybody. Thank you for watching. We'll hope to see you next time. Take care. The opinions expressed in this video are mine and solely mine. Healthy debate is always encouraged. Hate is never welcomed. So get over it.